Most people in San Diego take for granted the beautiful environment that they live in. But San Diego won't stay beautiful without our help. The Del Mar Fairgrounds is committed to protecting our environment and educating others to do the same. A zero waste program has been adopted here at the fairgrounds, but we need your help in achieving this goal. Let us tell you a little bit about our environmental protection and energy conservation programs, and then we'll share with you ways you can help. The Del Mar Fairgrounds addresses waste disposal in a very serious manner. In addition to having multiple disposal bins labeled waste, recycling, or compost, we have a team whose primary job is to sort through our waste to further ensure its proper disposal. We also do our own hauling of recycling and trash, which allows us to find the best pricing on our materials. Over the past few years, Fairgrounds Recycling Program has accumulated a combined financial benefit averaging $1 million annually. I'm Nancy Strauss. I'm the Resource Conservation Coordinator for the Del Mar Fairgrounds. Beautiful. And uh, word on the street is that you're pretty involved and pretty instrumental in the whole development of this program. So why don't you tell us about the genesis of it and your specific role, if you can. Well, we started our office paper recycling in 1985, and that was just to save a few trees. Mm -hmm. Slowly but surely, we started adding materials to be recycled, and now we divert 28 materials from the landfill every year. Ultimately, we divert over 90% of our solid waste on an annual basis, much of which is horse manure and shavings. <laughs> and um, we earned over $75,000 last year in just revenue on bottles, cans, and cardboard. Wow. Well, our cooking oil during the fair is collected by a company that turns it into biofuels. Mm -hmm. We also collect all of our electronics, our lights, uh, CFLs, right and they all get to uh, be recycled. We've won about 26 awards um, over the course of quite a few years, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Um, but a lot of this has to do with the fact that we've been able to get grants from the California Integrated Waste Management Board, which is now Cal Recycle, mm -hmm. and um, the Department of Conservation. Those grants have contributed about 150 to almost $200,000 now in equipment. Wow. So those blue containers you see on the grounds that collect all our bottles, cans, and programs right. Which are, there's a lot of them out there. Yes, are also, and our, and our balers are also um, these, from these grants. And we, I don't think we could have done it without right. them. The ocean is an invaluable feature of the Del Mar Fairgrounds, and because of that, we bear an even greater responsibility to reduce marine pollution. Storm drains lead directly to the ocean, and anything that is not filtered out of runoff water will jeopardize the well-being of marine organisms and the aesthetic appeal of our beaches. That's why the Del Mar Fairgrounds has adopted an extensive storm drain pollution prevention program. I'm Gary Reese, and I'm Chief of Plant Operations at the Del Mar Fairgrounds. Awesome. All right, and if you could try to maybe explain to us the uh, storm drain pollution prevention program. And what you have behind us is a storm drain or discharge point. This is one of five where in the event of a rain comes and storm water th comes throughout the fairgrounds, it'll go to this discharge point. Okay. And right now it's locked down. So in event of a major spill or problem, like say like a tank or spill of gasoline, this would protect the discharge going to the river. Oh, okay. So it's only designed for a rain event, and that's the way our, we can protect the oceans and rivers near us. There's some areas where, like, we wash cars. We only have one area where we can wash vehicles, and there's an oil separator in there and solid separator. So what it does, it does separate oils, it does separate solids, and then we collect and, and uh, vacuum that out and dispose of it properly rather than going to uh, the storm and or sewer. Right. Uh, we also have in our new project at the arena, we installed a quarter million dollar uh, storm water filtration system. So all the storm water goes through a filter media and then gets discharged to the river. So it's another way to protect uh, the, our rivers and oceans. Along with that, we've got uh, inline filters for the uh, filters on the, from the roof. So anything that enters the gutter goes through a filter before it gets before to, the, it even gets gets to, to the, that filter. Wow. So we're filtering, filtering, <laughs> and we're protecting, protecting the oceans and the river. Which, obviously, pretty important because we are right on the ocean here, and yeah, we absolutely. want to keep it as beautiful as possible. Keep it beautiful, safe, and we can swim and feel comfortable that we're doing our part to protect the environment. 
The Del Mar Fairgrounds has also made efforts to conserve energy and utilize solar power. In 2003, a solar power program was started that uses one megawatt system with 9,700 panels on top of 11 barns. This system produced 1,350,000 kilowatt hours in 2011, equaling 16.2% of the total electrical usage. As far as uh, the solar panels that we have here at the Del Mar Fairgrounds, what, uh, what can you tell us about those? Well, in 2003, we installed over 970 photovoltaic panels. Right. And these panels are capable of producing almost one megawatt of electrical power. That's enough for about 140 houses to power throughout the year. Wow. So it not only saves us, saves us uh, money, it's uh, also environmentally friendly power for us. And, right. Uh, it, 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 produces about 15 percent of the power for the fairgrounds. So a worthwhile investment. Definitely. Terrific investment and uh, we're proud of it and Good. we'd like to do more. Now that we've covered our environmental and energy conservation programs, let's look at some of the things you can do to help reduce waste at the San Diego County Fair. You can start reducing your carbon footprint by using public transportation to get to the fair. You can save money on your fare entrance if you take the North County Coaster or a Breeze Bus. And you won't have to worry about parking your traffic. Another easy way to do your part in helping the environment is to bring your own canvas shopping bag to the fair. This greatly reduces the number of plastic bags that would otherwise end up as unnecessary waste. Last but not least, make sure you recycle your bottles, cans, and programs in the properly labeled bins. If you follow these three tips, you will be making a great contribution to the environment and the conservation programs here at the Del Mar Fairgrounds.